Somebody in the comments suggested that I read the book Untethered Soul by Michael Singer, and I did. And I wasn't sure t what to expect, but I think I'm happy that I did. Uh, no, I, I'm, I am happy that I did. My existential tumbling is not the result of this book. I think it's just a result of my searching in general. That being said, I think this book is is probably a, a good thing to read on this journey. The comment was on my book therapy video for the book Awareness by Anthony DeMello. And if the book Awareness is a call to something hidden in plain sight, describing the indescribable, the ineffable, the cosmic, then the untethered soul is more of a guide, a field book, um, Lego instructions if you will. This book is more practical steps to become aware, real tangible ways to sit in the seat of the self, which I like because I, I feel like throughout this search with my depression, anxiety disorder, obsessive compulsive disorder, blah, 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 blah with all this stuff, with, with my search, with my seeking, I always come across these leaders or these gurus or these, these speakers who say, let it go, just let it go. To that I say, what the f does that mean? I, <laughs> I really wanna know. Uh, and I've wondered that, and this book, it feels like gets into that more. This book is, it feels like practical steps. And that's what I was looking for with this book, a practical way to change. Anthony DeMello made me feel like a fucking crazy person without the, <laughs> the tools or the instructions to, to get it, to find it. Even though he's saying you don't need to find it, it's right there, it's like I need, I, my personality, I need some help. I need, I, I want some instructions. I need a goal.